The lady from Uncle. The lady. Hi, today I want to take a look at trying to recover your Google account when you don't remember your Google account's password. And for that, I'm going to enter the email address of my Google account and I'm going to click on next. And on this page, because I don't know my password, I'm going to click on forgot password. And on this page, I'm being told, yes, I have a recovery option but I need to receive the code to this particular email address and then I have to enter my code. But I don't have access to this particular Google account either, this particular email address, I can't enter the code. So I have to try another way. And on this page, I'm being told that I have a recovery mobile phone number and I can choose to receive a SMS or a text message or I can choose to receive a voice call. What if I don't have access to my phone because it was broken, it was stolen, I've moved countries, it's no longer valid, whatever. I can click on I don't have my phone. And on this page, I'm being told that I did not provide enough information for Google to be sure it's my Google account. I didn't know the password. I couldn't use my recovery um, email address. I could not reuse my recovery phone number. So basically I have the option to try again. The only problem is trying again and giving the same answers will not change the outcome. So I suggest that you read more tips to recover your account. And on this page, the most important information is this one here. Use a familiar device and location. So when you try, make sure that you use the same computer or the same phone number or the same tablet that you last used when you were able to sign in. Use the same browser. So if you are a Chrome browser, don't use Safari. If you're an app user, then use the app instead of a browser and be in the same location that you normally sign in with. So it, if you normally sign in from work, then be at work. If you normally sign in from home, then do it from, from your home. It also says that you have to be exact as exact as you can be with answers to your security questions. So let's say that um, you're asked to complete the recovery phone number or complete the recovery email address. Do enter it, even if you can't use it to receive the code to. At least you know what the recovery details are. If you're asked to enter your last known password, then enter it. And if you don't remember it exactly, a best guess is better than no guess at all. So the more information that you give, the better it is for you. Before you give up completely, there is one more thing you can try. If you can remember the password and you still can't sign in, I recommend that you wait 168 hours, that is seven full days, not a moment sooner, and then sign in with your usual device in your usual location and enter the password correctly and then try. If that fails, you might have to accept that the Google account is lost to you and that you will need to make a new Google account. Thank you for listening and goodbye.